Last summer, I traveled around Estonia on my unicycle. I slept most of the night in a wild camping spot and this one is one of the nicest I found. But in today's video, I'm gonna find one which was even better. Hi, my name is Sylvain and I'm riding a thousand kilometer around Estonia. Subscribe to my channel to discover this wonderful country with me and follow me along on this last episode on EU map as I visit Lubia Circuse Talu. After a two day in Kardla neighborhood festival, I was excited to get back on my unicycle. Moreover, my next stop promised to be very fun, as some of friends were organizing a circus festival in their circus farm. But before I start the 12 km ride awaiting me, there was something I wanted to try. Unicycle do not really have gear, but we have something that more or less replace the gear. It is the size of your crank. So far, I've always kept my unicycle in the longest configuration that give me more control. Because I think you've noticed I was pretty new with this unicycle. But right now, it's few days that I feel more comfortable. I thought that today might be the day to try to change the length of my crank and see if I can ride faster. Damn, this is definitely way less of a big deal than what I expected. So, it's time to go. I passed by my intersection of the hard road choice for the third time. But in general, I was extremely happy to ride. And it was funny that this was a day when I got the most people who wave to me from their car or stop on the side of the road to ask me questions about my travel. Aha, we are almost here. I love the really colorful and human vibe of Helena and Uli Circus et Talu. Meanwhile, it was only early afternoon and I have few hours before the show starts. So I decided to take my unicycle to visit one of the nearby lighthouses. <laughs> Near the lighthouse, I came across Tuli. I've met her a few years ago while performing in a festival in Pepsi Lake, on the exact other side of Estonia, which is a good example of Estimal on Vaikemal. I 
even while fitting my unicycle in a car was a bit tricky. I was happy to come back by car because the show was starting very soon on Circus et Talou. Hey, hey! Hey, hey! Perfectne! 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 <laughs> I obviously made a small demonstration of my unicycle skill, or at least I tried to. That's why I don't drive very fast, because that's why I let the trip take a lot of time. <laughs> <sighs> Finally, here is some kind of a village and I'm running out of water. I'm so thirsty and I'm super tired. So the goal is find someone in a garden and ask him for water and then Find a place to sleep. Home, ciao, bye, bye. Hiu ma ja lain sarremale juba. Aga etkel leidame veesi, mul on nagu... I really need to drink. Oh. I didn't find anyone in a village to give me water. Meanwhile, I found this well in a garden and as no one was around, I decided to just get in and help myself with some water. I struggled a bit to figure out how was this system to work. But then I realized that I should hold in the other side to get my water. 
Once my bag of water full, I kept going on my road. So I thank you for the little fans, the kisses. I'm so tired, so tired. I've been like looking for a place to sleep for like almost an hour. And look at the amazing place I have for my last night in Hiyuma, actually. Tomorrow I'm already taking the ferry to Sarrema. Best bet of my life.